moving to Bristol, I've learned so much about Somali culture, but I didn't have that type of upbringing. When I was living in Holland, I just, you know, was part of the Dutch community, so I just felt more Dutch. And coming here, it was just a culture shock for me. You know, I haven't been around a lot of Somali people. I don't speak the language. You know, I'm, I was just so different. I was, wasn't used to so much diversity. Coming here just really opened my mind. كامي صوماليا وحن او امي مركن حلكن امي فامي الكيغا دربانك وحن كوبرتي وحن كسو برتي ابهاي ابهاي باي بري اني بوير ساقر مرو بكو ديان جيري سيدو صوماليا درامسكا ان كدي مركن وينا دي ان يوكا امي وحن اسكو ديي ان ان لبقف او مارتي عان اكو ديدو لماذا قف وحي كليهم داود علي مصحف يو حديدي ودمتين مكا لماذا ودي بوا دمتين مركا مرور بيه كان سكوت يشيرين إنا 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 كوبا يدو سيدة دربان كلا تومايو سيدة جيتار كلا تومايو ولي بعود كا أدبا نتشا علي سيقل فتقيسة وحن سمايايا وكلا خميس كستا وأنا أقول لكم أن أنا أقول لكم أن أنا 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 أقول لك أنها تتمكن من المشاهدات التي تتمكن من المشاهدات التي تتمكن من المشاهدات This group has been going on for like roughly around a year and all we do is just play some basketball, enjoy ourselves, have some fun um, on a Friday afternoon, just like let loose, you know. My whole life I've been living in Bristol. So I used to live in um, Eastern and then I went to Barton Hill and then I came to St Paul's. Because most, most of my family moved here before my, my mum and my dad came. So they already had like a community kind of, you know, of just family, I guess. I guess there were a few Somalis that were living in Bristol and Somalis tend to gravitate towards each other because they're like a very tight-knit community. Yeah, my name is Ilyas Muhammad Ali, Abdi Iga Yusuf Ilmi Arale Farah Fatah Shirton. Somalis, what we do is um, we have like a, we keep track of our names and our like ancestral names. So like uh, your grandfather's, your grandpa's grandpa. My father came here at the age of 19. And so he came here before the war to study. He went to university to get an education. His family, most of his family, he's got a lot of siblings. Somalia's got a lot of siblings. They were still back home when the war broke out, so he was in between uh, learning at his university in Newcastle and working and living and sending money back home for our family to survive. My mum moved to Bristol with her brother, and then my father eventually, with um, a couple of friends, moved to Bristol as well. And my parents got married here in Bristol. My mum. Uh, she's Madagascan. She's Madagascan, so obviously uh, she was born and raised in Madagascar, but then obviously she moved to Somaliland, Hergesa. So that's where like her Somali came, and like she speaks Somali and everything. But at the same time, she speaks French as well. At the house, we speak like different languages if you want to. So yeah, but my dad, he was born and raised in Somaliland, Hergesa, 
and then yeah he just moved to Bristol around like 2008, 2009. My grandma first moved to Bristol for like four years and then that's when she made contact with my mum and then she asked her like how was it in Bristol and stuff and then she was like it's a very nice city everything so she just asked to come down. She came down there, she just, she just had a thought of moving here and then she did in the end.